On behalf of Jonathan and David, it is my pleasure to extend a very warm welcome to each of you. We are gathered here to share in a celebration of love and to join together again and forever, David and Jonathan. I am so thrilled that we are finally here in this place on this stage with these people. How lucky are we? It's funny, when we first met, we decided to give this a shot. There's distance involved, but that first and second date, that was it, that's all I needed. I said it before, but I still feel like the luckiest guy in the world. Of all the men that you could have proposed to, you picked me. When I first got out of that car for our first date, I thought to myself, he's not only incredibly handsome, but he rocks a button-down and a cardigan like nobody else. I will forever be with you during the good times and when times are more challenging. I promise to love you forever, and I will do something every day to remind you that I love you. So when I shared that I was planning to propose with my family, I was faced with a question. How do you know? I immediately realized I could not imagine my life without you. Simply put, my life is more better. I said what I said. A complete with you in it. I will love and cherish you. I will always respect you. And I'll continue to run after as many taxes as I can when you lose your phone. So, to answer my own question, we are of the luckiest guys in the world. But it's more than luck. It's purpose. And you are my purpose. Now that you, Jonathan, and you, David, have promised to give yourselves to one another, it is my great honor and pleasure to pronounce you married again. <laughs> you may kiss!